Hello YouTube, this is a Photoshop tutorial by alphacomputing.net on Photoshop GIFs such as this. Now, I didn't set it to repeat because I originally made this as a boot up screen. So, start a new document in Photoshop, Control N, start a new document. and just set all your pixels up and your sizes and so we start out by choosing a background color go to black and now we want to open up the adjustments panel which can be opened by going into window adjust of window animation and if, th and if this box here doesn't pop up with this frame, just click on the, click on the button in, in the bottom right, convert to timeline or convert to animation log to frame animation. So, add your images to this as you want them. So I'm going to find my image. copy and paste that into here size it down to the appropriate size shift so it doesn't hold shift so it sizes it down evenly or just mess about with it size it down evenly and so now you can begin adding frames so this could be frame 1 nothing happening so then do select that frame and click on the new frame layer whatever du so it duplicates that now we can add anything else we want we can add we could do what I previously did and add the glowing up or we can do something completely different like we could add the gradient in red slowly coming up from the bottom so we can add this full frame So this will slowly rise from the bottom. Next frame. Bring this up. It's about there. Next frame again. Drag it up. And again, next frame. And so you're basically making a movie frame by frame. So that's about it. And now you can add the delay of each frame by selecting the first one and while holding shift select the last one. This will set it to all of your frames. Just select, you can select anything. You can select from no delay up to your set delay. I have no delay. So one frame, next frame, one frame, next frame. So play it. That is what we have. We can set it to continuously play. Then if we want, we can add it coming back down again. Oops, went wrong. Then to delete a frame, just click on the delete frame. And here, and so I will now duplicate these. And how do I flip them? There we go. 
forgotten how to flip them. How great. Tutorial that I forget stuff in. So I'm now going to have this fade back out. So I'm just going to do everything I did, but the other way. So that is it, and then we play again. Fades up. Fades down. Fades up. Fades down. Okay. Now to save this, you want to set, you want to go into file, not save and not save as. You save for web and devices. Click into that. Select GIF out of the menu up here, out of the drop down. GIF. No need to go through all these options. The main thing you want to focus on is this down here. How how many times you want it to loop. You can have it going once, like I had my image, or just going off forever. And you see it's a lot faster here, but it's just because it's a preview. It will save it as you saw it before. So, click save, save it here, save, saving, there you go, it has saved it, in my pictures file. Now you you have to open this with a browser because you just have to and if it, if it doesn't automatically open with a browser just drag it in just open a browser and just drag it in there you go that's it it's looping up down up down feel seasick Feel free to comment beneath, post your own video response on your own GIF image made on Photoshop, GIMP or any other program. Alpha Thanks at for watching. Alpha feel free to email net for any review requests, questions or any other general tech questions. Feel free to join us in the chat room, alpha computing slash chat. Alpha computing dot net slash chat. We play some games, alphacomputing.net slash games. And follow me on Twitter, twitter.com slash alphacomputing for on the spot updates on new videos and any new upcoming videos. Also, alphacomputing.blogspot.com for a small blog, although I think I might be cancelling that sometime soon. Thanks for watching. Alphacomputing.net signing off.